with One of a Kind for the craft along the day. Yes, we love being here at One of a Kind and sharing some crazy fun things. So we have a really crazy project to do today. We're making the telephone card kit. And if you're crafting along with us, you'll need a few supplies. Yeah, so before we get started though, we'd like to introduce ourselves in case you're new to Crazy Creations. My name is Kara. And I'm Jackie. And we are the mother-daughter team here at Crazy Creations located in beautiful Wairika, California. We specialize in outline stickers, card making kits, handmade velvety smooth glitter paper, and so much more very much more and today like jackie said we have a craft along kit it's called call me which is like a telephone it's an old-fashioned telephone and you are going to want your kit along with some basic supplies now if you didn't purchase the kit that's okay because watch us we're going to show you a bunch of technique and get you excited about the crazy creations yes so a couple of things before we get started that basic toolkit includes a paper trimmer scissors adhesive um, tweezers and some alcohol markers and if you're not watching like kara said you're going to learn some techniques uh, if you're if you're not crafting along with us today you're going to learn some techniques but we have a special prize or surprise for you. We're gonna give one of these kits away from the comments on our video and one from the likes. So if you like or comment this on this video, you are eligible to win this kit. Yes, yeah, so you have 30 minutes and it's on this uh, segment right here that you need to comment or like and then we will pick two random people to win one of these Call Me kits. And Ooh. I think that's fun, right? Yes, let us know if you're excited about that. Now, and, and also, uh, Jackie said we need alcohol ink markers. Can you tell them we only need four colors? What four they colors. Are? It's uh, black, so in the right art markers, that's number 100, a light gray, which is CG02, a dark pink and a light pink. So that's RV17 yes. and RV00. And if you have other brands like Copics or Spectrum Noir, that's perfectly fine. You need a black, light gray, dark pink, and light pink. All right, so let's get started. I can hardly wait. Me too. So this is the beautiful card we're gonna be making together. This is the telephone uh, card with a specialty fold. Yes, and so the specialty fold basically just means that it's not your normal card where all this would be covered. We're actually going to be altering our pre-scored card and making it kind of fun today. So in your kit, there's a couple things we'd like to get you out, uh, get out right away, and that would be our outline sticker of the telephone, which is called Call Me, and our beautiful handmade silver glitter paper. Yes, so this is our microfine glitter paper that we hand make here at Crazy Creations. So you'll want to remove that from its packaging. And the very first thing we're going to do is give it a nice rub, or we call it burnishing. Yeah, so you do that to remove any excess glitter. And also, the oils from your fingertips are making the sparkle come out of the glitter paper. And of course, we want everything to be sparkly and blingy. Yes, and you'll notice when you go back to touch it, you don't get any sparkles on your fingers. It's really wonderful. It is a wonderful product. And again, it's handmade here at Crazy Creations. Now, normally we color on white, but a lot of people don't realize you can color on our glitter, our colored glitter paper as well. Yes, so, but before we color, we'll need to peel one of our outline stickers. So this is the Call Me outline sticker. All of the outline stickers that we sell are vinyl, and you can peel and stick them on any surface. So today we're going to be using this telephone right here. And so I'm just going to peel the outline of the sticker. And it's really easy to peel. And then I'm gonna place it on my glitter paper. Now, if we look at this image, we have this little um, cord here that we're not going to color. So I'm gonna hang this off of the edge of my paper. Yes, because it's a solid piece that we aren't coloring, we really don't wanna to have to fussy cut it. So we're gonna manipulate it so we don't have to cut it out when it's time to trim, right? Right. 
Okay, so I noticed when you peeled that you left behind this little circle inside. So all you have to do is go in and we have our wonderful tweezers here at Crazy Creations, super sharp. And then you're just going to add that back, right? Yes, because I think that's where you have to put your finger to dial the numbers. Yes, that's this the old fashioned way. <laughs> now I do want to just point out with our outline sticker, there are four telephones on here and this kit does make four cards. Yes. All right, so now that we have our sticker on the glitter paper, we are going to rub it down with our finger. So we're burnishing again. Here, I'm gonna put this over here so we could kinda see that. So this is just making sure that it's nice and stuck. And, and if you wanted to, you could turn it over, right, and give more pressure from the back. You could, just like that. Now this glitter paper is glitter paper. It's like any other paper. So when it's time to adhere it, you're going to be trimming it out and you'll use your favorite adhesive to adhere it to your project. Exactly. Okay, so if we look at the example here, um, this is a really simple coloring that we're going to do. So I'm going to start with that little hint of pink in the middle. I'm going to grab my RV17 and my RV00. In other words, a light and dark pink. I'm gonna take my dark pink, just add a little bit to the bottom there, and then I'm gonna take my light pink, and I'm just gonna blend it into the rest of the phone. So you just want a touch of pink. Then I'm going to make my way into the bottom of the telephone here and these sections here. So it looks kind of like a gray area. And for those, we're gonna use number 100, which is black, and CG02, which is a light gray. I'm going to add my dark color first to the areas that I want the shadow. Now this is where you can blend and blending on our glitter paper is so easy because it just moves the color like you've never had it before. So that's why it's so popular. Yes. All right, now I'm on the light gray and I'm just going to finish these sections. I'm just going to the edge where that dark or the black ended and I'm pulling it into the middle here. So now we have that nice beautiful shading with a shadow and a highlight in the middle. And having that gray behind it just really brings that gray out. It's really sparkly. And then for the finishing touch on our foam, we're going to color the rest all black. So how simple is that? Oh, so no shading at all. And that brings that silver sparkle right through the black, which gives you a different look than if you were on the white glitter paper that has gold sparkle. Exactly. So we're not losing any sparkle. We're just altering the color of the silver glitter paper. I think that is perhaps some of the easiest coloring I've ever seen. <laughs> it's so easy. I know. So our outline stickers are not only good on the glitter paper, but you can put them on any medium. That would be uh, patterned paper, cardstock, acetate, vellum, uh, glass, wood. They go on everything and they are pretty much a one-time use. Yes, and you will have some negatives left over and you can use those by, um, if you have a transfer sheet, you can use these negative pieces that are left behind. Yes, yeah, so that's a whole nother thing that you can look up some of our technique videos and get some ideas. All right, so we're all done coloring our telephone. It was really easy and now the only thing left to do is to cut it out. Now we do want to share a quick tip with you about this little cord here. So. It's up to you, but you can totally cut through. Do you have your tweezers? Yes, you right here. You can cut through this little piece right here if you want to make it easier for when you do all the cutting inside of here. Yes, so you can completely cut it off and reconnect it because remember, it's a sticker. Right. Okay, so follow the border, cut out the telephone, and to get this inside, I also cut through right above the sticker, cut this out, and when it goes back, you don't even know that I have a cut there. It's our little secret. Okay. So that's going to be your homework. We're going to start the um, guts of the card now. Yes. Yeah, so here we go. So you are going to need your paper trimmer to do the actual card. And we're um, going to notice that we're going to have to cut quite a few pieces of paper. So it seems like a lot, but actually it's just your pre-scored card your pink heart paper, this plaid paper which on the back has the black hearts, and then this black 
cardstock, which by the way is already cut to size. Isn't that nice? Oh, that is nice. Okay, so we're going to put a cheat sheet right next to where I'm cutting so that you can refer to this as we're going along and you don't get all, you know, mixed up, okay? So we're going to start with our pre-scored card. You're going to want to fold that in half and it's going to be portrait style, which is this way. And we want to cut all of this uh, extra part off the top flap so we only have one and a quarter from the fold. So I'm going to open it up and I'm going to place the fold on one and a quarter and trim. Okay, so now our card looks like this, okay? All right, looks good. And you're gonna wanna save this because we'll be cutting this and utilizing it. You know, us paper crafters use everything. All right, next up is our plaid paper. Four and a quarter by five and a half. But to note on this one, we want these hearts. So you want to make sure that the hearts are going up and down when you cut the paper. So we're going to cut the plaid, but make sure that your hearts are the right way. So four and a quarter by what? five and a half. Five and a half. Perfect. And I just want to mention that this beautiful paper that we're um, using today is from Authentique. Yes, it's beautiful. All right, so now we're sticking with the black heart. So if we turn that plaid extra piece over, we have our black hearts and it's half an inch, right? Yes, half an inch by five. Right there. And a half. This cheat sheet is really helpful. It is. And by the way, we're getting so many wonderful, kind comments. Thank you so much. Don't forget that you can like the video and you can comment and um, then you're eligible to win this kit as a prize. Okay, so the good news is you don't have to cut the remaining piece because it is one and a quarter, but you do have to trim it to five and a half, okay? All right, so we've cut all those. Look how fast we're going, Jackie. What do you think? I like it. Okay, so we're going back now to the scrap. And by the way, did you say if we're going too fast they could replay? Not yet. So this video is available for replay if you need to rewatch it. All right, so our pre scored card is four inches by three. So we're going to go to four right here. And I believe if we turn this, it is three. So perfect, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, gosh, Jack, you're doing such a great job. All right, pink heart paper, here we go. We want the right direction. And what are we doing now? We have 3.75. Is there any way you can use the top ruler so we can see the measurements? Oh, now it's lit up. There we go. All right, 3.75 times 2.75, so all that's right. two and three quarters. And by the way, these are all in the directions, okay? So we have this piece right here, and guess what? One more piece, that's it, yay. So this is one and a quarter by five and a half. Okay. Now we do have a question. Do you offer these papers in your store? We do not. Not these specific ones, but we do have some authentic paper pads. Right. Okay, so if you got through this whole list, you have now cut everything you need to cut, and it's time to just put it together. What do you say? All right, that sounds great. Okay, so let's go to it. All right, so I'm, I'm hoping you're going to read me the instructions, but I know that the first one is this plaid paper goes right in here and it matches all the sides. Yes, yeah, so we're going to adhere that to the inside of the card. Okay, you're giving me the finger. Do I need to move up? <laughs> I'm pointing up. So you the can... pointy finger, I meant. Okay. There we go. Now we can see it. Okay, perfect. All right. And then we're going to take this little heart piece right here, and we're going to put that right here on the inside next to the fold, okay? So if you were to open this, you see where that goes? I'm going to just kind of put this off camera for a moment. I'm, You can hear my roller going, right? Yeah, that's our Tombow Mono Adhesive that we love so much here at Crazy Creations. Yep, okay, and there's that. Now what are we doing, Jackie? 
Um, you tell me. I think we'll do the front flap right here. So now we're going to go to the front part right here. By the way, if you don't tune in regularly, um, you may not know that Kara designs all of the cards and then I help with the coloring um, and shading on the stickers. Yep. <laughs> but she has me read her the directions. Right. Okay, so we have this here. And if a little bit of white showing here, that's okay, because you can see we gave you a border sticker. So now it's time to put these pieces together. So basically, the white is going to be the anchor, the black is going to go on it, and then just to let you know the way that this goes, it's kind of matted like this, okay? So we're going to put all three pieces on. And that's where your telephone goes, right? Yeah, so it actually looks like a square, but um, it's actually, the other part of it is hiding behind that strip. Yes, and we want to use the white to give it that strength because if you don't have the strength, um, it's not very good, right? Right. Okay, so we're almost done, believe it or not, with this whole part. So we're just matting the pink hearts onto the black. So we're giving a little bit of black peeking around all the edges and that just adds a really nice finishing touch. And I'm having trouble because there, whoops, no. I need to have it closer to me. And this is why I like the Tombow so much. I could lift it up, right? Yes. So you can reposition go. it. Okay. That looks really good. All right, so now this is the only part that you may not know how it goes is you see how we put this on the top? This piece is actually gonna get adhered right here about an inch down and a little bit over from the fold and then this piece is gonna go over that to hide it, okay? So when you do this, you just wanna kinda of check. You don't want it to go over, but you could kinda of see how that works right there. I love that. Okay. How did you come up with this? It's so clever. You know, I just decided to do different things. <laughs> you know, I just sit there and my mom actually, Sigrid, helped me with this idea. Let us know in the comments, do you like these types of cards that have an interesting fold or a specialty fold? We think they're really fun and we'll keep doing them if you like them. Now you want to make sure you kind of get over here. I might go a little bit more because you could tell how the telephone's a little bit wide. So again, my Tombow. I love that. Okay, and then I'm going to put this on top. So Jackie, you're going to be up next showing a little bit about our borders and then we're ready to give a lot of announcements. We do. We have some really fun things to show you, so you definitely don't want to go anywhere. Okay, so now once you cut out that telephone, it goes right here, and then you just want to probably reinforce with the bone folder that fold, but look how nice that is. That looks really cute, and I love this color scheme. Now let's look at some of the embellishments that came in our kit. So we have a sentiment sticker right here. This says hello. Hello, everybody who's watching right now. Yeah, really. So we're just going to peel... You can use your tweezers or your fingers. I think I'm gonna use my fingers. Peel that sentiment. And it's just gonna go right on the bottom here. You can even use your plaid if you need something to help you um, keep it straight. Yep, or you could put it at an angle. Who knows, everything goes, right? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> okay. All right, that works. Then we have our lacy borders right here. So this is gonna go right on the edge here. And we're just going to peel one of those strips off of the sheet. I think all of these borders and extra details, they just add to the whole project, don't you think? Yes. Now, if you have a little bit of white showing, this is where we can hide that with that beautiful lacy border. Yes. So you don't even have to cut really perfect. Look at that. And then we're just going to trim the tail. Trim the tail. Just like that. And then we have, what else do we have in our kit here? Well, on the inside, you could also decorate any way you want. We kind of put a lace, a straight one, but any way you want. You have lots of border stickers. And then we have these holographic dots and our numbers. I think you should show the numbers. 
Okay, so here are the holographic numbers. These are kind of new for us, um, and we're just going to peel and stick, and they're really fun for this um, telephone card. So. Yeah, and you can put them any way you want, but you know they are new. They're not even on our website, are they? Shoot, mine keep jumping off the page. Well, you should weed them. <laughs> I should weed them. But yeah, you can even put your phone number on there. And by weeding, this is what we mean. Folding down the corner and peeling the background off. Yeah, it makes it a lot easier to connect with that, right? Right. So these are going to go on this little strip here. You can do any pattern you want. You can do any numbers you want. You have a half sheet of those. And then we have our little holographic dots. Three of them go right there. And you can alter those if you want to with your alcohol marker. Which leads us into our challenge. Yes, so we have a card making challenge for you. Are you up for a challenge? I'm up for a challenge because a challenge always means a prize. Yes, so here's the challenge. We would like you to complete the rest of your cards from your kit and um, take a picture of the polka dot version of your card, the polka dot phone. Yes, so there are two polka dot phones. We want you for the challenge to use the polka dot phone. Now, if you want to do the same exact card, but with the polka dot phone, that's great. If you want to use your own papers and show us something totally different, as long as you have this polka dot phone on your card or project, it could be a scrapbook page, it could be anything. Yes, yeah, so take a picture of that card once it's done and then head over to our group called Crazy Creations Crafting Groupies, post it and use this hashtag on the screen, call me challenge. Yes, yeah, so how long do they have for this challenge? You have one week to enter your card in this challenge and then we will pick um, several winners. Absolutely. So you go to the Crazy Creation Crafting Groupies and you put in the hashtag Call Me Challenge. And we, of course, need a photo of your beautiful project. Yes. Okay, so we also have a deal here for a special deal for all of you, one of a kind, because we do have a sale of sorts in our sale area on the website, and we've added something just for all of you. Yes, so what we've done is we looked through all of our holographic number stickers, and we put them in a bundle for you. So these stickers are usually $2.25 each, um, but this bundle has six colors, and we put it on sale for $9.99 just for you. Yes, and there is a time limit on this one just because it's for you. And so you'll want to go in and you'll want to buy that, but it's red, pink, gold, blue, green, and purple numbers. And I'm sure you could find all different things to do with the holographic numbers. Yes, so, and there's a limited quantity available. So if you love these holographic numbers, now's your chance to get them in a bundle. So you want to put our website up again and tell them where it is? Yep, our website's on the screen, crazycreations.us. Click the sale category, and we just added a bunch of items to that sale category on the website. There's some um, markers in there, some alcohol markers. There's some wood markers to color on wood. Yes, they're called graphites. Uh, yes. There's a scarecrow card kit. And the best bundle of all, which is going fast. Now this was released yesterday, so it's not too late to get this deal. There are how many of these? 40. 40 double stick stickers. So these are sticky on both sides and you pour your glitter or your gilding flakes on top and you rub and they're just beautiful so if you're not familiar go and look at our website under double stick stickers you'll find some ideas uh, maybe on our facebook group or groupies but i gotta tell you this is has a value of over what Nine, this is a value of $90. $90, and it's on sale. All of these stickers in one big mystery double stick bundle for $29.99. $29.99, so go check that out, okay? Yes, it's in the sale category. And then um, limited quantity available on those as well. And then, of course, we wanna show you some beautiful cards from our card making subscription box. 
Yes, this is our new um, monthly subscription box that just got released just in time for the March 17th festivity with our leprechaun here. And of course we have our wood charm. So this is a belly band that goes on there. And I love the saying, I love shenanigans, right? We also have a hanging plants card in that uh, club kit, a wine, and this beautiful butterfly. Yes, so if you're not in the club already, you are totally missing out because club members get the newest um, stickers first. These are all brand new outline stickers. They won't be available for individual sale until next month. So the only way to get these is to join the club. So yes. let's talk about how to join the club really fast. Okay, so to join the club, you're going to want to go to crazycreations.us and you're going to look up the card club subscription box. And you can, well, Jackie, why don't you say you're better at this? Okay, you'll want to click the link that says monthly kit clubs and then get started. And then you can select if you want the monthly, the three month, or the six month plan. So the monthly cost is $30 a month and it's shipped on the 10th of each month and uh, it includes shipping plus you get everything you need. Now our clubs usually make anywhere from 12 to 15 cards. Yes, so um, again, and all subscribers get 10% off all of their orders. Now, I would also like to note that you can choose to prepay a three-month subscription or a six-month subscription, and that's at a reduced cost, but it is a one-time fee and will auto-renew at the end of your three or six months. Yes, so um, you have eight days left to get this month's box. So this is for February. And if you like these cards, make sure you select the option that says get started right away. Now, before we do our next um, promo here, can we show the inside of the telephone card one more time? Okay, here we go. The inside of the telephone card. Now we use that wonderful little envelope and put it on gray paper and put it over here. You can write your note on the back of that white paper that we used and then you can use your border stickers any way you want. All right, perfect. Thank you so much. And now we have something really special to show you. I can't wait. This is going to be our very next um, class. Yes, one of, a kind. one of a kind. This will be March 20th and we are offering this three card set and it's going to be with our new mandala flower sticker and we have yellow, turquoise, and orange. Yes, so we're making this brand new, so this is a new sticker as well. You get the mandala flower sticker, you get some leaf stickers, you get the bling, you get these black scallop border stickers and the sentiment stickers and we're making one card together, but the kit will make three cards. Yes, and we're not gonna tell you which color we're gonna do. We're gonna leave that a mystery, but all of them are put together the same way, but you can change up your color. So you are gonna use our white glitter paper, and you're gonna need about six different alcohol ink markers, mostly a light, dark, turquoise, uh, yellow, and orange. Yes, so again, this is for March 20th, you can head over to crazycreations.us and click classes if you want to join us. And should we do a quick little poll on which color is their favorite? Yes, I think we should. And uh, we want to let uh, notate that the sentiment is included. Yes, so you're going to get all this. Oh, and by the way, we didn't open it yet. Ta-da! So it's another fun folding card. Yes. Okay, so which color is your favorite? Yellow, teal, or orange? All right, so we're really excited about that. And let's pop up one more time. Thank you so much for crafting with us today. We had so much fun creating that telephone call me card with you with the specialty fold. We cannot wait to see your finished cards with the polka dot version of the phone. And we wanna see that in our Crazy Creations Crafting Groupies group. Yes, yeah, so if you're not part of our groupies, come on aboard because that is so inspirational, fun, and it's where all the people who do what you like to do like to post and get ideas. And it's so much fun. The people in that group are really kind. And I just wanted to repeat one more time that if you're watching this video, we're giving away two of those telephone crafting kits. We're gonna pick one winner from the likes and another winner from the comments. 
and we'll do that. We'll pick the winner in 24 hours. Yes, so I can hardly wait. I hope you're commenting below and liking, okay? So at the end of this wonderful 30 minutes, we just want to remind you that I am Kara. And I am Jackie. And we are the crazy ladies here at Crazy Creations. We will see you soon. Thanks for crafting with us.